Alright guys, I'm here with a Marvel Super Heroes CPS2 board, uh, A and B board. You can see I took the cases off just so I could work on the board. Um, this board works fine except for one issue. Anytime I leave it powered down for an extended period of time, the volume resets to zero. Uh, and yeah, I'll show you right here. It's in the menu, it's at zero. And if I leave it running for a minute or two, turn it off, and I come back within the next 10 minutes, it'll hold the volume, it's not a problem. The volume does go up if I need to. Like I said, it's fine. The volume switch goes up and down. Uh, the issue is when I leave it off for an extended period of time, you know, a good hour or so, I come back, turn it back on, the, the volume is back down to zero. It doesn't hold the savings. Uh, neither, this still is on battery, but that battery on the B board has nothing to do with the actual volume itself. So what I was told to, when I did some research, and I was told that this, there's a capacitor right here. It's called a super capacitor. It's right here. I'll show you it lit when I'm taking it off a little bit later. That allegedly holds the sound charge. Like it's a capacitor that holds the charge, so it keeps the volume at whatever you set it. I picked up a few extras here. They're real pretty cheap, actually, you know, like five bucks or so from a uh, digi key. So I'm going to switch that out. See if that solves that problem with the the volume just constantly resetting and you know back to zero after it's been off for a while. Well, guys, it's another successful repair. I was having issues, as I said earlier. Uh, with the board, every time I lift it off for you know hour, half hour, I turn it back on. The volume would reset back to zero, so I had to turn the volume up. So it was kind of a pain in the ass to constantly turn the volume up every time I had the machine shut down. Uh, Real easy repair. You can see right here. This is the super capacitor that I actually replaced, uh, and I did the trick. I, mean, I did some searching on YouTube, and until I, until I found that this was the problem right here. So if you have a problem with your CPS2 the volume resetting after it's down for a while. Try changing out this capacitor right here, the super capacitor. I got it. Here's a parts number in case you need it from a digi key. It's, it's a real easy to do. Two soldering points and you remove it, put a new one in. Just be uh, cognizant of the arrows indicating negative and positive, but that's, you can figure that out. It's easy. But that does the trick. So if you have a problem with the volume, go ahead and change that out. And, uh, it's, it's easy fix. It's probably harder to decase the board than it is to actually replace that capacitor. So uh, give it a shot and see if that works for you. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask.